reconnaissance aircraft. So they were flying it over the base that night in a perfect circular formation. And I think what the goal was is to see where the drones are coming from, uh, who's controlling the drones, and probably all that. And they're probably not, they probably know, but they're just not revealing anything at this point in time. Uh, this guy also put the NASA WB-57 is making very nice circles over Langley Air Force Base. And that it looks like there may be a 75 knot win over the southwest. So right there, you can see two. He put down a detailed map of what this WBF 57 was doing. NASA's trio of WBF 57s are specialized research aircraft that can be configured to carry a wide array of imaging and other sensors and equipment in their noses and other modular payload bays. In cooperation with NASA, the US military has made use of these aircraft on various occasions in the past to support operational and test evaluation type missions. So uh, this is the first one that I've heard of this and uh, in which they used it to as well. Let me go back on here just so I can pay attention to live chat. UAP delivery anywhere in the world. <laughs> it's the evolution. It's new cameras and an old platform. The beauty of it is its mechanical systems are immune to modern. Yeah, Cromwell Bear uh, stated that too. And I think they bring that up on here too, but, uh, that it can't be jammed. And right there, you can see, I don't know why they take pictures of aircraft like this and kind of give. That's one thing that the U.S. does do is you know, they take pictures of aircraft, of their own military aircraft and kind of give 